Mercedes Icaron 6213. And so we'll go and have a look. So, as we come into the cabin, uh, this is the first time that we've been in an inside cabin. Let's have a quick, just pan around and have a look as we first come in. Alright, so let's just start over here. Um, so you've got light switches over here. Um, something different that I haven't seen before is somewhere where you can put your card in. Um, so I think it just runs off normal, uh, like just electricity here in the cabin. Uh, we come up here and here's the thermostat. And this is the door here into the bathroom. Um, so we'll leave that for now and we'll have a look in one moment. Um, on the right side as you come in uh, is uh, a lot of wardrobes. Um, and from just looking at it at the moment, there is quite a bit of room. So here we have some space up the top here, uh, wardrobe space in here. Uh, we have two additional cupboards here. This is where you'll find the life jackets up the top and you'll see We've already filled it just with our bags. We haven't unpacked yet. Moving on, we've got uh, this cupboard here, and this is where you've got some space up the top where you can store even more items. A safe, um, looks pretty good actually, quite sizable. You should be able to get laptop in there, all your passports, wallets, keys, uh, a lot bigger than some of the other ships that we've been on as well. Uh, being a British ship, you can see that we have a tea and coffee and a kettle in there uh, with some mugs, uh, some robes. Uh, in the other cupboard adjacent here, there were some slippers as well. Um, they're just hidden underneath there by our bags. Uh, coming down here, you'll see that there is a number of drawers, very quite deep drawers, as you can see, uh, which is good, and there's four of them there. Coming across uh, here on the desk, this is where the hairdryer lives. Uh, we have another little tiny drawer where you can put some knickknacks there. And uh, there is also here a mini fridge and that is where our half bottle of, I think it's Prosecco, is actually stored. So everyone gets um, a half bottle of Prosecco when they come on board. Over here is the desk. So you can see that there's a TV here, right there, uh, a phone, and just some space uh, on the desk uh, with all the different guides, daily planner, voyage guide. I believe here on, on board you get uh, room service as well, which is great. Uh, just another small desk drawer here with some other items in there. Haven't had a chance to have a look. I think it's like internet packages, I think I saw just there. Moving over to the desk, let's have a quick look and see what we've got here. So, we can see that there's some American plugs here and uh, there is some plugs for UK. Uh, I don't see any USB, so I think the ship is maybe not as modern as some of the other ships that we've been on recently. Uh, there is a mirror here, just above the desk. Um, nice lights here, I think they look very classy. And then let's go into uh, the bedroom area. So just off to where the bed is, there is a chair, uh, a little seating area. They've left some masks here for us. Oh, there's the daily program there. And a little table. Um, the artwork. It's nice on the wall, it's quite simple. Um, love these lamps, they're sort of reminiscent of, I would say, uh, you know, hotels. <laughs> Art Deco. Art Deco, that's correct. Um, up the top here, you can see that there's these sort of cubby holes where you can store some items as well. Uh, each side of the, de uh, of the bed also include some uh, side tables, so there's some drawers there. Uh, light switches are located there 
um, and there is no it doesn't look like there's any power adapters at all uh, I don't think there is at all no so if you're powering your mobile or charging your mobile you'll probably have to do it off the desk uh, here's the bed so a nice big bed nice uh, array of cushions and pillows which is nice just the other side of the bed uh, and then the last thing I did notice as well are these uh, little storage cabinets here as well so just another place where you can store so at the moment it seems as though there's a lot of different options and places to store your items Hi Tristan. Hello. Hey. I'm noticing not really a full length, there's the long mirror, but it's not a full length. Yeah. It's so odd for a ship that's so formal. Formal, yeah. To not have a true sort of true full length mirror is odd. I don't know if it'll change in the different cabins you have. That's possible. Uh, here we have our thermostat, as I said before, and the bathroom. So let's have a quick look at the bathroom. Um, so the bathroom is compact, uh, which is okay. I mean, I think it's just need to get in there and wash that's about it um so it's there yeah it is a bit damp in here actually to be quite honest so um here uh they have a collection of uh soaps and body lotion i think it's is it penhaligans Pen Pen it's very posh penhaligans penhaligans is it Pen sorry i don't want to <laughs> i'll probably uh upset someone <laughs> uh, some glasses um, and it's all sort of you know it's not plastic it's all proper tapware which is really good to see this is glass which is good not plastic um, just a sort of a standard mirror which really is good sized um, shower actually yeah so let's have a look at the shower so this is the shower here um, one thing if you know us by now mm, the shower, shower curtain uh, we're not that hot on the shower curtains but to be quite honest it's quite deep here in the shower so hopefully we don't get that shower curtain sticking to us uh, but ooh, as I said tap wear it's a shower shower is a shower so is it fluffy cruiser approved yeah no I think it's the height though I think if you're I'm six foot two so I can just about get under I think I'm trying not to turn it on on me <laughs> but you can just about get in so I think it's okay yeah Good washing line across like that's the, the washing line up there yep our washing line doesn't actually retract it seems okay ah, no it's fine um so for all your lotions and potions as i said you've got a little table there there's not much storage uh, there's not no i mean you've only just got oh, okay. under the cabinet here as well okay. um so very sort of traditional style there i don't know whether this is a this is just a bin there that sort of slides out and yeah so that's it very basic very simple but I, do you need much more so let's just quickly have a, another quick look at the room. Oh, the bed test, it's nice, but um, yeah, I think most people will get rid of those. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, like, comment, and share.